Hello everyone, welcome back to another Sexy Ass Live. Well, this show is all about being open, being the person that you are sexually, knowing what you want, telling yourself what you want, telling your partner what you want, and not caring, and not feeling some type of way after you say it. Tonight, we are going to be talking about oral pleasure. Now, y'all know, Y'all know how I feel about oral pleasure. I love oral. And for me, oral pleasure is top tier. It's top tier. You have to know how to do it right. And my right may not be your right or your partner's right. A lot of the times people say, huh, I just don't know how to give oral. I just don't know how to do that stuff. That stuff is just not me. I, I'm just down there and I don't know what to do. And you know what my solution is? My solution is asking your partner. Asking your partner what they like. And if your partner is open, they're going to tell you just exactly what they want they're going to tell you okay i want you to do that the hand motion that goes up and down squeeze up and down up and down they're going to tell you suck the clip they're going to tell you okay baby i want you to make some little circles then big circles around the clip i want you to suck it while you're doing it i want the whole combo they're going to tell you, massage the balls while you're, you're sucking my dick, okay? That's how you learn. That's how you learn your partner. Being open is the best way to really get what you, get what you want sexually. And it's the best way to learn someone you're doing sexual things with. They have to lay it out. And really, you know, tell you what they want. Oral pleasure is, look, it's the best. It's the best. I don't know if you ever got your, your dick sucked. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> yeah, click licked, sucked. I mean, just, <laughs> I don't know if you ever did it. But when you do. When you do feel that urge of, okay, I think I want my dick sucked. <laughs> okay. I think I want somebody to put their mouth right here on the clit, suck it. And I want you to, um, I mean, really, I want it all. I want it all. I want to be dripping. When you can be that open with yourself, be that open with your partner, it changes the relationship. Example, and I'm going to use me because I didn't know how to, you know, suck, suck dick. <laughs> I didn't know how to do that. I had to learn. And especially if you're, if you are switching partners, your partners is not going to, you know, like the same thing. Some person suck might, may be they lick. Okay. Somebody's lick might be their suck. The, the other person suck. Like you can't go to another relationship doing the same thing. Honestly. So... <laughs> one day, you know, me and my husband, we was, you know, doing, do, doing the thing. We was, you know, having oral and all that. It, it could have been 69. I don't know if we were 69 or was I, you know, hanging off the bed. What was I doing? I don't know. Maybe I was just going, I don't know. I was doing something and I was about to suck his dick. And I was doing it, but I'm like, and he like, uh-uh, baby, I want you to squeeze turn squeeze i want you to really 
I'm like, okay, okay, okay. No, when I see that he was, you know, really liking this, a bitch guy. Hold on, hold on. <laughs> hold on, let me. Oh, and then another, you know, something I had to learn. I was going to him like, okay, because I've, you know, I've seen this on porn. A lot of women, when they're, you know, giving oral to a man, to a man they you know, suck the, suck the balls. I mean, they be sucking that shit hard and the man just like, oh yes. But now I know they could be crying. I don't know. But my, <laughs> I tried that with my, with my husband. He was like, whoa, hold up. No, <laughs> that ain't it. Do not suck my balls like that. Let, don't do that shit. I'm like, oh, hold on. I'm sorry. I didn't, I didn't know shit. I thought that was <laughs> I thought that was what y'all liked. They were like, nah, that ain't what I like. Yeah, look. So I had to learn what he liked as, you know, as a, you know, as a man, as a person with a dick, as a person with balls. I had to learn him and his body. I had to learn him. And the only way that I, you know, would learn is by him telling me what he liked. So it's very important to tell somebody what they like. Like, if you're sucking a, you know, sucking the clit, suck that mother, look. <laughs> suck that shit. <laughs> I want you to, I mean, I want you to make this sound when you, when you sucking my shit. I want you to, I want you to be sucking so damn. Look, that's just me. I want you to, oh, I want you to do it. When you suck it, I want you to suck it good. <laughs> but all honesty, like, the clits is just, mm, it's a beautiful, it's a beautiful thing. It's a beautiful thing that's just, that was ever created. Like, I just love the clit. I love you, clit. I love you. I love her. I love her. And it's so important to tell your body parts that you love them. Look, this, this, these body parts been with me for, since I was born. Oh yeah, I thought y'all was about to get my age. Y'all probably already know. But <laughs> these body parts has been with me since I was born. Although I am a, you know, an old soul. Not old, but I am an elevated soul. You know, I, I've been in different, bo different bodies. But this body here, I'm going to tell it since I'm here, since it's holding me tightly. It, I mean, it's holding me tightly. It's, it's all connected. It's just, it's on me. Since it's here, I'm going to tell you how much I love you. I'm going to tell you how much, you know, I care. And, and I'm so thankful that you're, you know, you're bringing me through this, this realm. I appreciate you. And it's important to tell your body, to tell your body that so yeah i hope you guys enjoyed this episode and you know follow me on instagram at m g e n i i i m genie um you can also follow me on twitter with the same name y'all let me know what y'all want me to talk about because i'm ready it, it, just throw them at me throw, throw them don't throw them but you know just tell me what what y'all want to hear me talk about? Because I have some experience on some things. And I want to get them off my chest. But tune in. Ooh. Tune in next Wednesday. I got something good coming. Something real good for you. Bye.